Beaver can't finish your Kirk pal. Let's see what he has to say. What's he got for us this time? That probably flew away. A fishing out of squeeze. It's a guilty pleasure. A fishing out of squeeze. It's a compound measure. A fishing out of squeeze. The lights shoot the camera. Smile for the world and panorama. He likes to impersonate walk on. Buddy of Fishing Now is Chris here, or Batman. Now nah, I'm not gonna do something like that. I'm sorry. Yeah, my hair is a little weird with this three dollar half cowl I bought at Walmart, but yeah, as you can tell, I'm a Batman fan like everyone else. Actually, my Batman fandom goes all the way back to when I was a kid, watching the '89 Batman, like, well, like everyone else. But that's not what we're here to talk about. Today, we are here to unbox and review the Dark Knight Trilogy Blu-ray box set available from, well, most outlets. I actually had to go to five stores to find this one. Everyone else is unboxing the Steel Book and the Digi Book and the Bat Cowl. I was actually looking to find this one because I actually did not own Batman Begins. I do own uh, different versions of the Dark Knight. You can see the Steel Book right there, DVD Steel Book. And I actually have... The Blu-ray Bat Pod, which I showed off in a very old video in and around the town about a long time ago. I don't remember exactly when. Uh, Rosie, my girlfriend, got that for me. As well, well, you can see a bunch of stuff. This Justice League shirt with Batman on it. Another gift Rosie got me for my birthday. But yeah, I digress. Anyway, let's go ahead and unbox this thing and see if this is worth $30. So first you can see we have the cowl. And the cool thing about this is that uh, I actually know Film Fan Pete. Uh, specifically wanted me to mention what material and how sturdy the uh, slipcase is actually made out of. It's very similar to most, well, hard cover slipcases, basically. So let's uh, slip these out. Mm. They're very snug, but not too snug. Let's put those aside. And as you can hear, it's very sturdy, very hard. And it's made out of, I, I can't really describe the material. It's kind of like a hard cover book. Uh, very similar to a, another Blu-ray I reviewed in an upcoming roll call, and you'll know which one I'm talking about once you see it. So on the front we have the cowl, Batman Begins, Dark Knight, and Dark Knight Rises printed on. You can actually feel the outline of the cowl. That's actually pretty, it's not like embossed or anything. You can, it's kind of like sort of lightly laser cut. You can feel that. And on the back we actually have the bat logo, which again is made out of a different, very glossy material, so you can actually feel. The difference between the logo and the uh, box, and of course you got the spine. Nothing really inside. There's like you know, there's digital copy codes and such, but nothing really too special. And the other reason I bought this box set was for this book, the art and making of the Dark Knight trilogy. This one's very thin. Uh, when I saw the DVD version, it was actually a lot fatter, but I don't think the uh, material is any different. Uh, I don't know why. So I'm just skim through this quickly. Got a bunch. Of, they discuss all three of the movies. How. Uh, the art and production of the films went. There's a couple of those, yeah. And on the back it says, You Must Become Fear. And they have a couple pictures of the, well, actually, of all the villains in the franchise. The big thing about the set, the inside, which has the exact same artwork. It's also made of the exact same material. And it's actually a gatefold, like they used to do. On the back you have a uh, list of each one of the movies and information that goes with them. Same spine as the box set. And you open it up. If this one, the Batman begins with the bonus features. And uh, you can actually see a picture of the Batman looking out at Gotham City. And you open that. You have both the Dark Knight and the Dark Knight Rises with uh, two bonus Blu-rays of special features. And, cool thing, if we take out all these discs, you will actually get to see the Batman logo Underneath it all is will take a minute, so we'll just cut to it all complete. So yes, as you can see here, this very beautiful shot of the Batman logo. I believe it's the same one that they use in the Dark Knight, uh, going by the blue and black, like the Dark Knight went with. So that's that's. I just think that's really cool. It's a, it's just a very very well done box, set, especially for the price thirty dollars, because it's not made of any cheap material. This isn't three Blu-ray. Cases all put in the one box in a very flimsy case. This is a just a quality, quality box set. 
and I can't recommend it. I mean, if you don't own any of the movies and would like to get them all on Blu-ray, I say this is a good box. If you're a collector like me and you've already got the Digibook and the Steelbook, I'd say this is a good addition to the collection. However, be warned, because as cool as this box set is, there's actually a flyer inside, uh, an advertisement for a, another collector's box that's coming out. No pictures, though, so I don't know what it looks like and what makes it any different. Uh, so when you buy this box, you actually get a voucher inside uh, to save some uh, money off when that box that comes out, as they put it in, uh, in, when it comes out in 2013. They don't have a set date. But I'm probably not going to pick that up because I'm perfectly fine with this. I just wanted all three of the movies on Blu-ray in one set. I don't care what the other one comes with. I mean, if it was more bonus features, maybe. But as I understand from the voucher, it's just going to have more uh, memorabilia. So it's probably going to have, like, a uh, probably probably uh, the bat as, the, you know, the, the, the vehicle from Dark Knight Rises. Maybe it'll be, like, the bat, like the bat pod was. And Batman Begins had uh, different editions. So... Yes, that was my unboxing of the Dark Knight Trilogy box set on Blu-ray. I hope you enjoyed the video, and have a good day. Bye.